There you see the starting lineups again, and it's pretty much what will probably the superstar, the main guy on this team. When you talk to Nick Nurse, it's a number of different guys he's looking for. OG Ananobi coming back from injury. Siakam, putting. former teammates there. You see Ibaka manhandling Westbrook to the ground. Floater from Harden, and he has his first bucket. Expected. See what he can do here. Finished with 13 points on 4 10 shooting Tuesday. And a block from behind by Clint Capella. How about the long arms of Capella there? Gets beat, but is able to recover. James Harden and the tap in. The first game between these two teams just a couple of nights ago. A lot of penetration. That lane was porous on both ends. Westbrook's first. Because he's used to having it from the get go. I wouldn't be surprised if they give it to him and. As we see the two-man game there with Capella, give it to Jason. As you see him meander around the lane there, is when he doesn't have the ball in his hands, can he still be effective as we see Gordon spot? And our other guys out on the floor that are going to have to share the basketball, you have to remain engaged. Ibaka pivoting, turning it around, and getting it over. back. You can see the defense that Nick Nurse is trying to employ this year. Westbrook up top for Capella. Harden. Good ball movement from Houston. Rivers pulling up. And a nice bounce. Gerald Green appropriately named as an always a green light. Norman Powell takes his first shot. In that it's tough to be able to gain consistency coming off the bench because your minutes vary night in and night out. But if you ask Nick Nurse, he said he's going to give him some opportunities. As he gives Clint Capella a breather. The 18 for that Siakam's been working on ready to shoot. There's a takeaway. Siakam all alone. And the flush finish. Points here in the first quarter. Harden. It's going back on McCall for three. And he drains it. Let's do the dance. See the Raptors good movement. Not a real post position right now. Even with Gasol in the lineup. Extra pass outside. Malcolm Miller. So I think his decision to turn it over was smart because otherwise it's susceptible to a block. Just couldn't get up enough. Speaking of blocks, there you get one from Tyson Chandler. Green. Rockets retained. Eric Gordon driving past Ananobi and gets the lane to go. An awful lot, and at times it, it can be taxing um, to have to do it, on, especially when you're adjusting on the fly, so to speak. There's Russell, who just blocked one previously, was not deterred, went right at him again, and was able to finish. Patrick McCall. And Ibaka cleaning it up. A little isolation here. Westbrook. Drives it to a double team and dumps it off for Tyson Chandler. Followed Ibaka right on his back. Russell with the good find. Good ball movement from Toronto. Here's Russell. Kicking it outside to Gordon. Takes another one. McLemore back to Gordon. The second. Raptors playing tight defense. O'Shea Brissett missing on the dunk. Tries to go back on the reverse. A little more control. Norman Powell. Way off on the three. Good defense that time. Getting a hand up, challenging that shot. Quick pass for Fred Van Fleet. He rattles into the three. Ready, Van Fleet. See Harden. Finding the open man. It's P.J. Tucker. And cross underneath and come out the other side. Now you're running straight into the corners. Raptors on the run and Ibaka drowning the dunk. There are a lot of young players in the league should be looking to him for inspiration. Played for Greg Marshall at Wichita State did Mr. Van Vliet when they had with the lead 50 to 48. See the attention Harden gets even off the ball. Coming in on the runner able to finish. Oh, he got fouled too. You can see him lobbying. Norman Powell. And the Raptors ahead by three. 11 points for Powell so far. The lob up to Capella. Approach next time. Van Fleet with tight defense on Harden and the ball tipped away. Here's Van Fleet leaving it up for Siakam. McLemore. Bad shot. 
No reason to take that shot. Here's Powell for three, and that is good. Can't put it in front, he'll take it. Siakam loses his footing, Harden kicking it outside to Tucker. Takes the three and hits. Name into the proceedings along with Norman Powell. That man right there with the ball as well, Ananobi. Good pass inside to a block. There, Van Fleet pressing the issue but got it blocked. Westbrook taking the pass from Harden, finishing at the cup. Got to be able to make those reads on that pick and roll. What is the defense doing? And you got to adjust accordingly. The read and react part of the game. Van Fleet kicking outside to Siakam. Pat that his coach can rely on game in and game out. Harden now one for five on threes today. Powell, three. Not sure why he shot that, but it'll advise nonetheless. James Harden. Athletic for sure, but one of those tweeners. What is his game? Not a good enough shooter to play the two or the three. Hollis Jefferson and Stanley Johnson, two former Arizona Wildcats on the floor. Daniel House going to the rim and finishing with the can't convert. Gasol's deflection started that exchange, just unable to convert the Raptors. Austin Rip. Three point game. Just over 30 seconds to play in the third quarter. Westbrook ties it up. Seven seconds to go. Two point Raptor lead. Here's Westbrook right through the lane to the cup. Shot. Just 29% on three-pointers. Well, they are led by James Harden. He has 22. Oh, he shot six for six. Exit soon as well. Just get a couple more trips up and down. Westbrook putting on the moves and finishing with the foul. Teamed, finding Gerald Green alone. And it's rebounded by Davis. Terrence Davis on the crossover and the lefty finish plus with some of the Rockets top players Well to the average fan it might not mean much, but if you're one of these family 17 points down To take it 134 129 over Houston here. They have the lead in the fourth quarter and that are This is 22 points Four assists three rebounds here today Chris Clemens <laughs> Austin Rivers, and the point, Clemens again, he and he hits again. It's on this roster. Taylor has it stripped, gets it back. Boucher with the tip in. All still loose. Here's Austin Rivers, takes the three, and it's put back in by Gerald Green. he did that. Yeah, Gerald Green, 12 years in the league, he can still jump really high. Yeah, 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 still has the ups. Isaiah Taylor traffic and it's taken by Matt Thomas. Good defense by Thomas having his hands up. Didn't even see the ball really, but the hand up got the deflection in three. Rockets in the lead. Taylor finding Hernandez, dumping it down for Chris Boucher. If you come to the middle, catch and look opposite. That's exactly what he did. That baseline was wide open. Able to break the defense down with two passes. Hard in season Steve. and you wonder, you, you you see the tandems forming in the West, but the Warriors are not the same Warriors, obviously. Eight seconds on the shot clock. Clemens hoists it up. The back tip. Rockets control again. McLemore hits the three. So a six-point lead for Houston as this one winds down. 15 seconds to go. Hernandez's three is off. Here's how both teams were able to get into the painted area. Yeah, they shot some threes, Houston for sure, but the dribble drive was open too. Defense is not yet where they want to be. Well, that'll close it out in Tokyo with the Rockets.